Hello again, everyone. Edwin Lurie back once again. In this YouTube astrological segment, I'm going to be talking about Pluto in the fifth house in natal chart. Now, um, some of you may remember when I first started my YouTube astrology channel, I did a series on the Pluto placements in the houses. They were a little bit concise, and some people may refer to them as snappy. So, what I decided to do was make another series on them in which the videos would be a little bit longer and more descriptive. So anyway, first thing up, well, Pluto in the fifth house can be comparable to Pluto in Leo, but naturally you've got to blend it in the zodiac sign with it. Pluto in Leo in the fifth house can be different than Pluto in Aquarius in the fifth house as an example. Now, um, Pluto in astrology is connected with passion and desire. So if you have this placement, you may have a lot of passion and desire for uh, love, romance, um, children. You may be very passionate about activities connected with children. It could be um, sports, you know, uh, party event planning, even parties you know, in general um, could be something, you know, Leo Fifth House related, such as acting, you know, entertainment, doing something you know, with the military against sports. Um, creative endeavors. Uh, it could also be, I mean, when you have uh, this placement, there may also be you know, a strong passion for, you know, speculation, you know, uh, conjecture, uh, investments. And the thing is, uh, Pluto is also connected with uh, intimate connections. So, you know, you're intimate, you may, the, um, People that you're in romantic situations with, the connection may be deeper and more intimate than in a lot of other instances. Now, um, intimate connections may also figure prominently. It could be in sports activities, uh, games, hobbies, your general fun, amusement, and enjoyment. Uh, it can also be, you know, these people, you know, may take on some kind of, you know, Leo like characteristics. Remember that the fifth house does correspond with the zodiac sign Leo. So intimate connections can be rather, you know, extroverted, you know, magnanimous, generous, um, vivacious. It can be people that are courageous, you know, those that are you know, flamboyant, um, showy have swagger and confidence as some examples. And uh, they may also play an integral role in matters with speculation, conjecture, and investments. Now, Pluto in astrology is also associated with power and control. Now, the thing about this is that you know, if you have this placement, you've got to guard against you know, being overly, let's say, domineering in matters with children. Um, with lovers, you know, being overly controlling, you know, getting a power complex or power syndrome, if you will, with those people. But you may have a strong desire to have that, uh, that power and control and matters connected again with speculation, conjecture, investments, um, it, really your own personal popularity, uh, you know, your, your own confidence. You know, not letting others diminish or deplete your confidence, kind of being in charge, you know, of you having you know, your self-assuredness, your confidence in general in matters. Now, Pluto is also connected with transformation and major change. So, the thing about this placement is there may be, you know, a major change at some point or transformation in your love life. Um, it could be you know, with, with children, you know, per, your personal popularity. Remember that, you know, Pluto is extreme. It could be where your person, your personal popularity, you know, could be really great at one time, and then it goes completely the opposite the next or vice versa. And also to, you know, just um, you know, transformation, you know, maybe in, in terms of, you know, what you derive fun, amusement, and enjoyment from. It could be matters with sports, games, hobbies. Um, you know, you may experience a transformation, which you believe, you know, regarding investments or what you're investing in. 
Now, another thing about Pluto, it's also associated with rebirth and regeneration. It's about, you know, revival, you know, resurrection, you know, not literal resurrection, but, you know, revival, say, of a business or whatever it may be. You know, it could be something, you know, naturally it's in the fifth house, so it could be something connected, you know, with children or a romantic um, connection. You know, it could be where if you had a hobby, that went figuratively dead for some time, and then you it was revived and you rekindled an interest in it. That could be an example, or some sport that you may have been interested in. Say if Pluto is in um, Sagittarius in your fifth house, you know that sport, you know, maybe something Sagittarius related, whether it could be something, you know, with darts or archery, you know, something that involves you know a target. Uh, it might be you know, some rebirth or revival connected with your personal popularity or even something connected with speculation and investing. Now another thing too is that you know, the fifth house given that it's romantic partners and children, if you have Pluto in the fifth house, you know, those people you know, may be ones that could be very probing, incisive, deep. You know, investigative, resourceful, passionate, uh, but they also may be overly, you know, obsessive or fixated, sometimes even jealous, manipulative, or vengeful. Now, Pluto in astrology is also associated with, um, you know, with, uh, you know, really are, you know, are you know, things that are connected with death or endings and figurative deaths, you know, like obliteration, endings of things. And the thing about this is is that at some point, you know, the person may experience some kind of ending associated with their personal popularity. Um, it could be a creative endeavor, something that is sports, you know, related, say if it's Pluto and Scorpio in the fifth house, it could be some extreme sport as an example. Even, um, and endings are not always bad because it could even be something with gambling. In some cases that might have been to the person's detriment could be a romantic interest and in some cases that might not have even been you know, beneficial uh, to the person and then something that uh, a love that you may have had whether it was you know a sport a hobby or some kind of game um, game and the thing is to uh, you know Pluto in astrology is also associated with support whether it be moral emotional or monetary support so if you have Pluto positive in the fifth house in your natal chart some cases it could be you know you might show a lot of support in matters you know with the death of the dominant parent or keep in mind you know this is eight eight houses uh, from the tenth you know, the 10th house is the dominant parent, which is often the father, so you may be someone that's willing to give much support in this matter, whether it be monetarily or what have you. Um, it could be in you know, matters you know, with lovers, with children, uh, willing to give a lot of moral, emotional, even monetary support in those matters. Your support may be somewhat extravagant. Remember that the fifth house is connected with the zodiac sign Leo. And it might be, you know, showing support simply by, you know, expressing, you know, extroversion and, you know, vivaciousness. The support, um, you know, you may support certain, you know, um, things, you know, like whether it's, you know, something with entertainment. Um, you know, it could be. You know, the thing about this too is that it's also, you know, you may um, you may get support for your, you know, just general support, encouragement, moral support, and the things that you, you know, really thrive on. It could be, you know, with your sports, games, um, hobbies, you know, the things that you enjoy um, in general. And another thing, too, is that Pluto in astrology is also associated with surgery and trauma. Keep in mind, the fifth house does correspond with Leo. So the thing is, there may be a surgery and trauma connected to the heart, the spine, the upper back, the sides of the body. Um, surgery and trauma, any surgery and trauma, a lot of it may be very extravagant. 
Um, it could be something that was tied into sports or some, you know, uh, recreation activity. Maybe um, it affects your personal popularity or surgery and trauma may have more of an effect on you, you know, in terms of your general fun, amusement, and enjoyment. And also the fact that Pluto is positive in the fifth house can indicate, you know, those things of enjoyment, you know, may be connected, um, you know, the occult, which includes astrology or doing something with forensics or investigation, um, things associated, you know, with horror or, you know, could be you know, things that are you know, connected with maybe recycling as well or transformation, whether it's, you know, rebuilding a home or, you know, an engine or vehicle or what have you. Anyway, people, that'll conclude this YouTube astrological segment. Until next time, Edwin Leonard saying stay well.